As you know, here on The Final Wager, I enjoy a thorny wagering scenario, but not when I get in after midnight. I prefer a double lock, and that's exactly what I got tonight. Thanks, Troy. But I do want to look at a daily double situation that Troy had with four clues remaining. He had 25,200 pages in second with 7,400. What does he have to do to ensure that he will return the next day? Let's say Paige gets these last four clues. We have a total of 12, 28, 48, $6,800 outstanding on the board that Paige could snap up. That would give her a total of 14,200. If we double that, that's 28,400. So for Troy to guarantee himself a victory, he'll need to wager 3,200 and get it right. All right, as we found out, Troy doesn't really like Pulitzer Prize winning plays. So what if he wants to force Paige to get all four right. Let's say that she gets these three highest level clues, 16, 2000, 2000, that's 5,600. If she gets that, she will have uh, 13,000 even. So to get to 26,000, which is double that, Troy will need to wager 800, so that's another possibility. As it turned out, the 500 wager was just fine. In that case, Paige would have had to get both $2,000 clues. After getting the $1,200 and $1,600 clues, she had $10,200, which is how she ended up. And you'll notice here, and I'll change Troy's wager to this 24-7 total that he got after missing the daily double. You'll see here that if she gets the $2,000 clue for the five-letter South Pacific Island, she would have $12,200, which would not be enough to catch Troy. So she has to guess on this and on the final clue. She kept the buzzer down, and she's going to finish in second, barring a strange wager. All right, let's check out what happened with our final wager. Both Paige and Troy nailed this one, and they both made acceptable wagers. Nice job, guys, and congrats to Troy, who becomes the third male champion in three weeks. Oof, really racking them up. But he looks strong, and I'm looking forward to seeing how he does. As for me, I... I am a huge Dave Chappelle fan. My brother, after we recorded last Friday's video, watched an entire disc with me as we always do when we hang out. It's just a, a tradition. And he was doing stand-up at Radio City tonight and for my birthday a few weeks ago, my girlfriend got me tickets. So she and I went and we had a great time. Enough bragging out of me. Troy, we'll see you tomorrow and we'll see you tomorrow on the final wager.